Mr. Felix. Uh-oh. He's sound asleep. Now is the time to experiment with my latest invention. Poindexter, what are you doing? I'm trying out my new anti-gravity gun, Mr. Felix. Well, shut it off. Okay, Mr. Felix. I meant slowly. Sorry, Mr. Felix. What's keeping your uncle? It's getting late. The doorbell. Who is it? Space Graham for Mr. Poindexter. Well, what is it? Oh, dear. It's from the Master Cylinder. He says, I'm holding your uncle, the professor, prisoner on Mars. You can save him by following instructions. Uh, what are the instructions? Pack trunk with laboratory equipment. Stand by window. You'll be picked up in 10 minutes. Don't bring Felix. Well! What do you think, Mr. Felix? Start packing. If you've got to go, you've got to go. Now to get my anti-gravity gun. Cylinder. Now you go to laboratory and invent super rocket fuel. Oh, so that's why you brought us here. All right, General Klang. I shall do my best. Hmm. Felix. Hey, turn me loose. What do you want with us? I tell you, Earthman. Poindexter invents super rocket fuel, and I, General Klang, invade Earth. Yeah? How are you going to do that? With army, of course. Look! Rocket ships! Millions of them! And now you go see Professor, no? What's that thing? A hitching post for nosy earthmen. I snap on handcuffs, so, and leave you forever. Forever? That's a long time. Gee, what a tough break. Poindexter comes to Mars to rescue the professor, and I come along to help him. So now I am caught. Yes. You bungled this job, too. But why did the master cylinder do this to you? Ask him. He's over there. Huh? A master cylinder? Yes. Double-crossed by Clang to think that I'd be wearing these chains. On you, they look good. You two stop fighting. We've got to get out of here. Get out? Hmm, that's a laugh. I designed this dungeon myself. You did a good job. And it isn't funny. Well, I guess this is the end. You give up too easily, Felix. Who said that? I did. Hey, who are you? A Martian in disguise. We're fighting General Klang, the same as you. Watch it. Boy, I'm free! Thanks, Mr. Martian. Don't mention it. Watch it, Professor. Sorry, Professor. Bah! And now to rescue Poindexter. But, but how? Allow me. Yikes! The General! In the flesh! So 
to speak. Now, I finish you. No? Okay, Felix. I can handle him from now on. Good luck. Thanks, Mr. Martian. Then we'll leave now. Leave? You can't leave me here. What'll I do? You can rest in peace. Come, Felix. We must find Poindexter. <laughs> That must be Poindexter. <laughs> Poinsy, are you okay? Yes, Mr. Felix, but let's hurry home. It's time for my nap. To the spaceship. Gee, but how are we going to get up there? Easy, Mr. Felix. With my little anti-gravity gun. Hey, give me... Professor, I dropped a bottle. What's the idea? I was just trying to clean up. This place is a mess. I know. We need a handyman around here. Here, put this in the window. Hmm. Handyman wanted. Huh? A sign. Handyman wanted. That's the professor's laboratory. Oh, well, a job is a job. Okay, Felix, you're hired. Let me take your bag. No, thanks. I have my lunch in it. Okay, get busy washing those bottles. <clears throat> yeah, and don't break any. <laughs> Hmm. For years, I've been trying to get that bag, and now... I'll get it for you, Professor. Okay, but be careful. That bag is tricky. Yow! What, what was that? It was nothing. Uh, continue your work. Well, it's lunchtime. Uh, Professor, what good is that bag? Only Felix knows how it works. That's right. If I could only look inside. Hmm. I think I have an idea. What's that, Professor? Shh. This is liquid light. Liquid light? Yes. Felix's bag is open. You pour this inside. Then we can see how it works. Now I'll distract Felix. Oh, uh, uh, Felix, my boy, uh, uh, I was thinking. Huh? Oh, a glass of water for me? Thanks, Rock. Hey, I I'm fading away. Yeah, like 
like an old soldier. But, but, I don't get it. It's really very simple and quite clear. You're transparent. Oh, no! I can't understand it, Professor. Why am I transparent? Because you drank my liquid light, that's why. Yeah, and now you're next to nothing. Well, don't just stand there looking through me. Do something. I will, if you will do something for me. What? Show me the secret of your magic bag. Never! Okay, Bottlehead, suit yourself. through this door? No one! Professor! Help! Everybody goes right through me! Professor! Save me from that monster! Nonsense! It's just a clever illusion. I'll fix it. Hey, Professor! That clever illusion has sharp teeth! It's getting bigger! Oh! Oh no! Felix, help! Did you call? Felix, call off your monster! This isn't fair! Yeah? Well, what about me? Is this fair? <laughs> call it off, Felix, and I'll solidify you! Okay, but work fast! What's that stuff? It's liquid dark. Drink it. Liquid dark? This better be good. Oh. That's more like it. There. You are now good as new. Solid, man. Solid. Now get rid of that monster. Okay. <laughs> Monster. Oh, I feel faint. Professor, speak to me. Water. Here, drink this, Professor. Uh, where am I? Huh? No hands. Yeah, no heads either. Rock, you fool. You gave me the liquid light. Well, this is where I came in. <laughs> this machine should be making instant money, but where is it? The professor's instant money is pouring into Felix's house. I'll have to reconnect these pipes. Oh, no, you're not. Is this your instant money, professor? It's my money, all right. Rock, you blundered with the pipes. Disconnect them. Don't let Felix get any more of my instant money. Too late, boss. The mixture is all gone. I have the formula. I'll make another batch. 
What you looking for, Professor? The formula for instant money. It was here. This must be it, boss. Now, we've no money. Money? There's plenty over at Felix's. That's right. Let's go. This money belongs to somebody. Well, it'll just have to go back to where it came from. It's disappearing. Okay, boss. The old battering ram right through the door. Where's my money? Your money? Oh, no! That's right. He made it himself. Why, that's counterfeiting. And that's illegal. What did you do with it? I sent it back to where it came from. That means to the laboratory, boss. Hello? Hello? Police! Hurry! Hurry! Counterfeiters! Making money! Next door in the professor's laboratory! Hooray! Instant money! Hit the jackpot! We're set for life! Right! You're set for life! In the penitentiary! The police! You can't make money! Instant or regular! What's the use? And who is big and dangerous? Darn that TV set. I didn't get the names. Hmm. A big guy and a little guy with a big mustache. Rock Bottom and the Professor. Oh, well, I'm safe here. Professor, do you think Felix is home? Certainly. Knock again. It's cold out here. Let's go inside. The Professor and Rock Bottom. Uh-oh. They're in the hall. He's not here. We'll wait for him. Gee, won't Felix be surprised to see us? Yes, he'll never get over it. I gotta escape. Those guys mean business. The window. Oh, no. I nailed it shut from the outside. I'm trapped. If I only had my magic bag. But it's upstairs in the bedroom. Huh. The hot air pipe goes upstairs. It's dark in here. I see a light. The pilot light. I'm in the furnace. And the door's locked from the outside. Gosh, Professor. Felix is late getting home. Uh, just be patient. He'll be along. Yeah, but I'm getting chilly. The switch for the furnace is over there. Turn it on. Okay. Gee, 
It's getting warm in here. Huh? They turned on the heat. The heat? Gee, Professor, I'm getting tired of waiting for Felix. Me too. Here I am inside my furnace with the heat turned on. And the professor and Rock are waiting for me outside. I'd better scram before I burn up. I can escape from them if I can get to my magic bag. There's the room now. And my magic bag. Hey, this grate is locked from the outside. I'm trapped. Oh, maybe Felix is in bed already. Let's go and see. Bring the stuff. Come on, Professor. Uh-oh. Look, Rock, the magic bag. And to think that I could never make it work for me. Yeah? Let me try it. No use, Rock. Only Felix knows the secret of the bag. Huh? You did it, Rock. The bag is working. I'm scared. I wish Felix was here. Felix! It's nice of you to drop in. Okay, you've got me. Now what? Relax, dear boy. We came as friends. Don't give me that. You guys are wanted by the FBI. <laughs> Flash, public enemies number one and two were captured by the FBI today. Okay, so you're clear. But I still don't get it. It's simple, friend. We just want to be friends. Sure, pal. Ooh, a roast turkey. But we ain't got no table to put it on. I can fix that. Likewise. My birthday? I forgot all about it. 